So mena, eh hey, this guy is blessed. Oh, uh, so he actually. Hmm, let me not spill yet. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Oke Wumi, and this is the Big Brother Niger review and updates live on the Wumi Stock Show. In case you are watching my videos for the first time, a very big welcome to you. Please do not forget to hit the red subscribe button, turn on your post notifications so that when I post new videos, you can get to see them first. And also, let me see your comments in the comment section. <laughs> Straight to today's video. Well, anyways, welcome back. And um, today is day 59 in the Big Brother house. And um, as time goes by, days goes by, you know, every time, you know, a day passes, it's drawing near to the finale. And, you know, <laughs> the tension in the house is even hotter than before. So um, apparently yesterday, they had a flutter wave task where they were supposed to do something like hide and seek. They're supposed to hide something. And then the other teams will find it vice versa. So now the reason for Dora's um, anger is the fact that um yes okay she first went to complain to lecon this morning okay lecon called and asked her why her and also they're not speaking to each other and she was explaining to lecon why she was mad at also that okay fine she gets it again but it shouldn't have lied to her because apparently she was about to check a box for um what they hid inside the box because it was like an like hide and seek they were on different themes dorothy and also they were on different themes for the task and so she was about to check that particular box for what they were looking for apparently that was where the stuff was you know but because other did not want them to win now definitely it was a game and also said that ah, nobody hid anything in that box so dorothy took it very serious and she didn't even bother to look into the box she didn't bother to look in the box again and she was searching other where other places and then just for them to find out that actually the stuff they were looking for was inside the bag so she was upset that why would also have said that if it were, like she was just telling her that she was upset that also is her friend like why would he do that why would he go that far just to win a game so after that she was um and she went to the lounge after lecon was just like ah she should forget she was like ah, she, has, she has forgotten into that she's just saying why she's mad at him and all and what is annoying her is the fact that he's not feeling sorry for what he did so when she got to the lounge she brought it up again while and was also was cooking in the kitchen she was in, um in the lounge with tricky tea and neil and she, she went on to say that she told also that what also did yesterday wasn't funny and she didn't find it funny at all that he should have actually not said anything like she didn't ask him anything she didn't tell him where do you think it will be so she wanted to check so why would he why would he say why did he make her not to check again like he said that she believed him because also is her friend and she took whatever he said very seriously and she, she went further to say that if it was neo that said she should not look into the book she wouldn't have taken him seriously that she, she wouldn't have taken him seriously. but because also is a very close friend and then so when he told her not to look into the box she didn't look into the book because she took it and then eventually the stuff was in the box so she was really upset with also and the fact that also is not really sober is not feeling remorse about what he did is what is even hurting her the most so guys who do you think is wrong on this one like who whose side are you on do you think dorothy is right to be mad at ozo or do you think ozo was just actually playing a game with no hard feelings let me know what you think in the comment section below into the nitty gritty of today's activities why don't you all take a moment to have a look at what will be at stake for today. Mm. Okay. Immediately eliminated from this task. 
play the music starts from my head. Play, play the music, we get ready to dance. This has to be the biggest task in the Big Brother season. Like every season, we always look forward to the Inosun task because it comes with the biggest reward. This beauty. Oh, hey, hey you guys. I feel like if I was in the house, hey, hey, this task is always the most, you know, I feel like those people that missed out on this task, Omo, this task for me yo, is the biggest task in that house because it comes with the largest reward, which is a car. Guys, hey, Omo, okay, so um, today, the housemate, it was fun to watch because actually the innocent task for this year was just to test um the memories of the housemen how fast um how well they can keep things in their head for as long as possible even after they've been distracted by different things so apparently how they did this task is the first stage there were different stages um big brother will play a video for them to watch and that video can be showing different numbers or different colors the first one i think the first one was colors it will show different colors like the first color can be red the second color can be pink the third color can be blue the fourth color can be white and after they watch that video they will have time they will go and dance they will do something that they will not think you know some people they will cram the colors so <laughs> for those who that think they could cram this actual task big brother kept them busy before he now asked them questions so he made them either dance or do something play they should have played when they watch the video they would do something very playful to make them um try to forget if they crammed it what they saw in the video then they will now go and stand in a position then big brother can now ask them what's the third color that was shown on the screen after they've danced though they can dance for like 20 minutes so um a lot of the housemates ah they thought that ah they were going to cram and you know they would get it and that kind of thing but you know with the way they had to dance in the middle most of them forgot their answers even before biggie asked them they danced the way <laughs> what they saw in the video and so um that's that was how the game was played and it was a very interesting one because initially it uh, it it's it, it really <laughs> made them see how well they could hold things in their memory for how long how long they could hold things that they've seen visually in their memory so um um the housemate played this game and they were going one by one they were leaving one, uh, one by one lekon was the first housemate to actually leave the game and that's how they were leaving when they forget it where they cannot remember the actual color they leave they leave and so the last stage the only the three housemates that made it to the final stage of this task was um ozo neo and dorothy and beginner asked them to tell the housemates why they think they deserve to win the innocent um task and here is what they said uh, i feel like everybody knows how important it is to be mobile in lagos uber is expensive you spend money and you'll be tired so i mean i just want something that will just make my I'll life have easy. to move around in lagos and i mean i feel like everybody knows that it's not easy i did mention to i think tricky that the amount i have spent on this car services is enough to actually buy a car or even to and um i mean who doesn't want a beautiful car and it's one of my best colors as well is red uh the car is is one that it's a unique car and it's one that it's made in nigeria so it's a car that's going to take you to every single location that you want to get to as well and i feel like these are things that are synonymous with myself my personality what's I more like it's the third number in the video <laughs> yo yes, kindly take a step back Oh, yeah, come on. 
so apparently they were asked the three of them before the last stage of the game they were asked uh, what they why they would like to win the innocent vehicle task and um neo said ah you know get time to do uh can you that him he likes cars and definitely who like if he's going for an appointment that someone responsible will need a car to go that you know need to be bothered about traffic or entering public transport he already knows that he has one car also started he gave us brief history he said ah okay oh, for this car oh, wow. because you know son um, they actually their company is actually close to my village in enugu um and they are very their company is a nigerian made brand which i would like to write i was like isha praising us on it i said this guy <laughs> then dorothy came and she was like ah she who wouldn't want a beautiful car like this innocent car and that she would like to win this task or uh, that she's uh, that she has even been telling Chugiti that the amount that she spends on public transport is is like is so um outrageous and that she would actually love though she doesn't know how to drive but she would actually love to win this task and after their own reasons reasons um, they now played the the final stage of the um task neo also and dorothy so actually when they, they watched the video of numbers this time around it was numbers and um so they after they, they watched that video of numbers biggie gave them um they told biggie told them they must dance they danced they danced and danced after that biggie the three of them were in the arena and biggie asked them i think biggie asked dorothy the third number or something and dorothy was dorothy had forgotten she was already crying like jesus she already knew she was out so she was the first to be out of the particular of this particular round and she was sad because she actually wanted to win this task she was very sad and after dorothy left it was just neil and also remaining and guys this task eh? <laughs> Um, if I, I feel like if I'm there, I will pray before I will start to do anything. So um, it was Neo and Ozo. And then the Biggie asked the last question and Ozo got it right. Like Ozo was happy. He jumped up. I'm happy for him. I'm really, really happy for him because I feel like he deserved it. They put a lot of work into it. Each of them, they, um, they actually put lots of work into it. But for him to remember the actual numbers after dancing away all the stuff he actually has good memories and so he what he was so excited he was happy he jumped up like hey thank god who would not be excited after winning a bar now let me tell you guys um after that sham let me show you a clip of the housemate rejoicing with ozo Once again, congratulations, Ozomena. I'm so excited for him. Just as many of the housemates were happy for him, some other housemates were not really happy. Though I know if you if 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 it's me that lost this kind of task to somebody, I might be happy for the person, but I will be angry at myself for losing to somebody else this particular task. So Neo wasn't really excited. Dorothy was just trying to be happy. You know, when you are close to getting the prize, but you did not actually get the price you will be eh, happy for the person that actually won it but you will not be entirely happy you may be sad just because oh ah, i failed this particular task i was close but not necessarily angry at the person you may not just be excited so i feel like that's how it was for dorothy and neil but it is what it is one winner hmm. you guys let me tell you what also won also won an innocent vehicle ivm carries 2020 a 2.4 pe liter petrol engine turbo charging system power system smt and 580 electronic rear view leather seats abs plus ebd <laughs> reverse claim switch with indicator 10 inches display units with gbrs <laughs> bluetooth calling and answering system all in one car guys this is like a lucky win for us i mean i'm even happy because they know right um 
something like Big Brother winner on the car, so you can be able to ride it anywhere. You not be ashamed. Do you understand? The car is plain, and I just hope they did not write anything on it. <laughs> I'm happy for us, though, and. You know, this was one tax that all of them shall put effort in. And I feel like, you know, some this I can't say they should tip them because this vehicle alone is like a big something um donations that they made for this season. So guys, <laughs> unfortunately, unfortunately, that is all we can take for now on the Big Brother Niger review and update on the women's talk show. Please, if you've watched this video this far <laughs> and you haven't subscribed ah ah please i beg you please subscribe and also give this video a thumbs up and also let me see your comments in the comment section about what you think about um also and dorothy's um little arguments in the morning and also the innocent vehicle task have a wonderful day or night ahead bye <laughs>